Laura. I'm with the Free Press. How fine of I did a story on you last year. Hello, I'm ready. Hi, nice to meet you. Hi, I'm Taylor Hahn, your clairvoyant tour guide, as you know. Um, I will do my best to answer your questions as clearly as possible. And today, here with us is actually our hospital security guard, Emery. I'd like to go over some safety issues. I've had a lot of problems with this tour. Well, I don't know about that. I do believe this is a voice center for the other side, and I personally believe that certain people do attract certain kind of energies to them. Let's get on with it. All right, right this way. So, this is our first floor here. Weird. I was here 10 years ago. I did a story on a girl. She told me horrible things that happened to her here. Well, unfortunately, a lot of horrible things have happened here. Inhumane tests and experimental drugs were used on these patients, and that's not including the horrific cases of sexual abuse, mental abuse, and the use of the electroconvulsive therapy that these poor souls were put through. Anyway, why don't we move on to the next room over here? Before we go any further, I'd like to um, do a sage smudging ceremony. It's actually meant to clear any negative energies that we may be carrying. Does anyone object? Well, thanks. Not interested. Okay. Do you honestly think that that is necessary? Don't you remember what happened three years ago? You abandoned us. Or did you forget about that, Taylor? That was a long time ago. Things have changed now. Why don't we carry on into the left wing building? I can go over a lot more details if you have any questions. Where did Emery go? Oh, that is weird. Oh, he must have got a call in the west wing. He was just here a minute ago, beside me. It's like he disappeared. It's fine, I'm sure. Why don't we just carry on over? I hear children crying. I have never heard this before. What do you do for a living if you don't mind me asking? Well, I'm a land developer. Why am I picking up children? I've, I sense children. Well, maybe I know a few kids that got sent here. They used to run an orphanage. Well, this one in particular is where a young lady was once held. Emily Sanders. That's her. That's the girl I did the story on. This is getting weirder by the minute. 
Well, this floor actually, a lot of women were sexually assaulted and illegally sterilized for the convenience of this facility's belief system that children of the patients would actually inherit serious mental disabilities. And of course, we know that is ludicrous. She was killed two weeks after the story was published. And sometime this week is the anniversary of her death. Today. <gasps> what was that? I didn't hear anything. Somebody touched me. I... It was her. I know it was her. Sarah, come back. We come have to out. stay together. Sarah? Hey. Let's split up. I'll go down this way. I'll come with you. No, you go with that. I'm going with you. This is it. This is what? This is where I last saw her. Who? This is where she died. What are you talking about? We used to be patients here. Many years ago, I got in trouble with the law and they sentenced me as criminally insane. He sent me here, and I wasn't even crazy. I never have been. It was horrible, the things they did to me. Submerged me in ice water, solitary confinement, shock therapy, like I was some kind of animal or something. Good thing that happened here was I met her. She was the light of my life, and they killed her. They killed her. She's not a piece. Here, baby. I miss you. I love you. She hears you. There's nothing we can do. We have to go. You're right. There's nothing I can do. Please. I just need to be alone. <sighs> All right. But I need you to stay right here. Don't go anywhere. I need to find Sarah, so I need you to be here, please.
you know you don't have to keep a tail. Remember the past. You should have learned from that by now. What has happened to you, Emery? to leave now. No, we can't. I think that's Eddie that no. I'm here. You have disturbed the spirits. You've got to go now. It's all right. Don't worry. We're going to go find help, okay? Let's just go. Good luck finding help. <laughs> oh. 